Welcome back to my channel. Happy Tuesday. Um, I'm in Lowe's parking lot. I'm kind of in a little bit of a hurry today, so it may not be as big as a haul that I usually do. Um, the lighting is a little weird, so I'm hoping it's not going to mess anything up. I'm a little bit minimalistic on my look today because I was in a hurry, and I don't even have lashes on. After all those fantabulous lashes I bought, um, yeah, so... It is what it is. But anyway, happy Dollar Tree haul day. Um, I was going to skip today. I like went back to bed after I took Jack to school and I was just going to skip videoing anything and work on cleaning the house. And then I thought, who wants to clean the house? Like, I don't. So threw my stuff on. I'm like, let's go. So anyway, um, I'm going to dig into this haul. Number one, I got these right here again, and if you guys remember, I did that little video on those pizza, bowl, pizza bowls. Um, those were such a big hit in my house. Let me just say, they were a fantabulous hit. Everybody loved them. I'm making them again this week, so I needed some more of these, and they absolutely worked out perfect. These are the perfect size, and you get four for a dollar, which is a good deal. So, I was glad to find those. Because sometimes they don't have them, let me just say. And then I found something new, which I thought was pretty awesome. And I think my family is going to really like this. I'm not really, probably not going to benefit from this. I did get four of these, but it is the Bisquick Cheese and Garlic Complete Biscuit Mix. So you just add water and I would never roll them out. Like, I, that's just not me. I don't roll out biscuits. I don't make homemade biscuits. Um, but I would make drop biscuits, which is what I always used to do. So, these will be drop biscuits, and it's probably even telling me to do that, honestly, because it just looks like drop biscuits, I think, but they're going to be drop biscuits, if you know what I'm talking about. I'm just not a biscuit roller, or I'm not a chicken fryer, okay? I don't make fried chicken, although that's one of my favorite foods on the planet. I just don't make it. It's too messy. I never get it done completely right. Um, rolled biscuits take too much. Like, I, I just don't have that in my heart, you know? Like... You gotta have that in your heart to do that. So yeah, I don't. <laughs> okay, let me let me get my wallet up here so I don't forget that. Um, let me just show you this. It's just this is just a Boro item. Um, it's just the foam containers. You get ten in here. I've bought those on multiple occasions. So I'm honestly just gonna put them back here because I won't be showing this. Um, let's see here. Oh, I got this, and I'm gonna have to tell like um, Hallie and Josh not to like watch my videos until after Christmas. I got this at the $5 section. I did pay $5 for this and the little, this was the only one they had and the little, uh, hold on, I got a hair and it's driving me crazy. Get off. Okay. And the little thing right here is kind of sticking up a little bit. So I just need to take like a drop of super glue and just put it back there. But anyway, it says there's no place like home and it's a picture frame just to hang on your wall. So I'm going to look like in all of Hallie's pictures and I'm going to find like the best ones that I can find of like the kids all together or like her and Josh or everybody if I can. And I'm going to put them in here and I just think that would be a really cute Christmas present. So I'm definitely going to be doing that. And that's not bad for a dollar because that's I'm mean, for five dollars because it's really nice. It's like really thick, really well made. I'm really liking it. So yeah. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and show you the the wrapping paper that I got. First of all, I'm gonna turn on the air a little bit because it's a daggone balmy 57 out there, and I done got me a hot flash going on. So you know how that goes. Um, I was just going by. They actually had this. Um, wrapping paper back in the food section but you know they have to put it wherever they can because they have so much wrapping paper so anyway i love this I, they there was a few maybe four to five different ones i got the ones i like the best i just think it's very um elegant looking because it's like the dark blue background and you have like the stars are like um you know silver shiny and then the hat and scarf on the snowman is gold and shiny and i just think it's very classy looking elegant and then this one right here it's like silver paper and the stars are blue i just think presents are going to look so pretty wrapped up in that i did get a lot of wrapping done i started to do like a video showing you guys like my amazon Amazon haul basically because I did post a picture over on Instagram and I got a bunch more today But I'm like if I show those I cannot count on people in my family not to watch them and see what they got for Christmas 
So bummer, um, after Christmas, I'll do a what I got for Christmas so you can see what I got, but I just, I just don't feel like that they would stay away. You know what I'm saying? Um, so yeah. Um, anyway, this one here, and let me just say, there is, it's called metalized gift, gift wrap, and it's just 15 square feet, which is not a lot, and you know, I wasn't expecting a lot, so... And then this one right here, I absolutely loved. You have the different color white pine trees. They have a little bit of silver in them as well. And then you have the gorgeous deer. So I absolutely love this one. They are going to be so pretty. Just, you know, presents wrapped in them. Okay, and then I found two stockings, which I thought were flipping hilarious. So I had to get them both. They had two different colors. And look at these. They are like fish. They're, I don't know if they're, I don't know if they're supposed to be sharks. What do you think? Are they, wait a minute, that's upside down. I think they might are supposed to be sharks simply because of the teeth, as you can see. Um, but I wasn't sure, but I just thought they were flipping cute. If you had, if you had like a fisherman in your life, these would be absolutely perfect to cram plum full of like fishing lures and the fishing twine or whatever you call it. No, that's not right line fishing line and just bobbers and just wouldn't that be great for if you have a fisherman in your life i kind of wish i did um but i don't but um these will definitely be fine in a good home even for a little boy they, these would be cute i just think they're adorable they had the gray and like the blue i had to get them i just i had never seen those and i just thought they were so cute okay and then I got one more card. I just wanted to get this one for my mother-in-law. Um, it just says blessings at Christmas and it has the church on it. And honestly, I just thought this was so pretty. It just has such a country church vibe out in the middle of the woods. And I just loved it. And then I got, oh, this is something else I got for Hallie. I'm acting like I'm looking around to see if Hallie's around anywhere before I talk, but she's not. Um, this is great. I just think this is going to be gorgeous. It's the LED Crackle Glow, but I actually showed this on my Instagram as well when I showed some of the things that they, I, I might have did a, a walkthrough. I can't remember if I did show this, but this is, a, it says crafted from clear grass. Clafted, wait, wait, wait. Crafted from clear glass with a unique crackle effect, which is going to make it look really pretty. Um, LED fairy lights emit a soft, warm, white glow. I thought it was going to change colors. I'm kind of bummed about that. Um, powered by three AA batteries, not included, indoor use only. So, I just, to me, it looks like a crystal ball sort of thing, and I just think it would be really an elegant touch. I've been using the elegant word a lot. A really, um, um, magical touch to add to any like side table. They actually have it right here with like a plant, which I know they have like a lot of plants and stuff like that, or even like for a little girl's room. I, I might change my mind and give it to Kindle even. I'm not sure yet, but I just loved it and I thought it would be a cute little gift. They do have a, a few cute little gift ideas over in that Dollar Tree Plus section. So yeah. All right. I've been hauling this bag around for quite a while. So I'm finally glad to be getting getting all the stuff in this bag. Number one, I have this right here. And if you guys remember, I hauled another one of these. And these are just going in Jack and Ray's um, gift bags. You know, they're Christmas gift bags. They're little unicorns. They're cute. And they love stuff like that. They absolutely love stuff like that. Um, <clears throat> something else I have in here. And now I know. Hold on. Where is it? I know. Okay, I guess I didn't know. I could have sworn that I had two bags of cough drops in here for my mother-in-law. She asked me to get her some cough drops. Um, so, she had to wait till I do the haul though, right? I mean, anyway, um, this is just the best health honey lemon cough drops. Yeah, so there's that. I know I have another bag somewhere. Um, and then I got these two little throw pillows just because I thought they were so cute. They're basically just little, they, they're calling them plush, but they're basic, just little throw pillows, honestly. So if you have like your, your I mean, some people do this, I don't, which I would love to be one of those people that like when Christmas comes around, like I have like you know, like the bathroom set, the Christmas shower curtain, the bedspread and all that, pillow shams, rugs. I would love to be one of those people. Number one, I'm not that organized. 
And number two, I'm just not one of those people. So anyway, I just thought that if you were, this would be an adorable thing, like to put as accent pillows on your bed with your other Christmas stuff. So I just thought they was just super cute. So I grabbed them. They might have had more than that, but um, I don't remember. And then I got a couple pairs of the knee-high socks, and I think I got these for Jack. Um, let's see here. Number one, I know I got these for Jack, and these are not knee-highs. These are just juncture socks, and she actually picked them out. And the other ones are just kind of plain. You know, you got the plain blue or, or purple. And then this one right here she picked out. She liked the little mouse with glasses and the cheese. So that's, that's for Jack. And then these... Um, she was with me and picked out. So these are knee highs. She loves wearing these like over leggings, over top, like pulled all the way up to her knees. And I just think it's really cute, but it's the um, knee high, well it is knee highs. But this is the size five to nine. But honestly, Jack is wearing a size three right now and these fit her. They fit her and she can totally wear them. And I love how, you know, how high these are. And they're so Christmassy, I love them. So, and these are very long. Let me just show you guys. See how long these are? I mean, these are some long socks. The little cute little cat. And yeah, so we got that one there. And then we ended up getting this one here, which I'm just going to pull this apart too so you can see it. It's a little snowman. I love the gray with the snowman and then the red and white striped. I love that as well. And then last but not least, we have this one here, which is... I think it's just an elf body, honestly. Um, no head. I guess, I don't know. I don't know why, why there's no head. But anyway, the polka dots on the bottom. I just think these are very Christmassy and very cute looking. I'm, I don't know. Maybe there's a head. No, there's no head. Okay. So, I don't know. I don't know, but they're cute. So, that's all I can say. Okay. Let's get on. Uh, this is going to be a big sock. A big sock thing. <laughs> Let me just say, I ran into some gold toes, okay? My family is getting gold toes. Like, they are getting go some gold toes for Christmas, okay? I, whenever I see them, I have to get them. And these are flipping amazing. Hold on. I tried to get at least two packs of all of the new ones that I saw. Um, and I'm not sure exactly who's gonna be getting them. So the first ones I got are these right here. And the retail value on this pack right here is $8.99, so you get three pairs in here. Let me just hold them up here. And basically it just says, Gold Toe brand, three pairs, crew socks, for all day comfort, cushion comfort, arch support, moisture control, reinforced toes, and the sock size, or the shoe size, is six to 12 and a half, which is all the guys in my family. Um, I really, really wish, and I'm gonna try out a pair, honestly, I really wish that they would fit my calves because I know that these socks would feel so good on some calves. Like, I might have to special order me some because I got some calves. That's all I got to say. I got some calves, okay? Um, but anyway, yes, so I grabbed two packs of those. And I'm gonna save my favorite for last because they are just awesome. Just awesome. Okay, so next is these right here. You also get three pairs each in these and these retailed for of course they haven't covered up of course they do let me see oh yeah and then you try to peel it and everything peels off i'd say probably about the same as the other ones probably about $8.99 a pack um these are the three pair these are more like a dress sock um, it does say non-binding allows circulation moisture control reinforced toes all day comfort this is for shoe size six to twelve and a half so same i love the different colors here like they're just super super nice like these are definitely more dressy though and i don't really have anybody dressy that wears dressy stuff in my life but i think that anybody would really like those so um the next ones i got okay so all right, so I just got one pack of these, which I think I may already have one pack of these. And of course the price is covered up. This is shoe size six to 12 and a half. And you get three pair in here. These are, these look really big though. 
Um, it says reinforced toes, perfect fit, casual crew, ultimate comfort. But these to me look longer than the other ones. I love these. I love like the wider band at the top. So I got those and then these right here, uh, basically you get four pairs in here. And these are a little bit more dressier. I love these. They look like what I would call Argyle socks. Like, I don't know, but they just look like that to me. But I like because you get four pair in here and yeah. So that's pretty cool. Uh, the price on these is 20 bucks. Look at this guys, right here, there. 20 bucks for four pair of socks. Like that's amazing, right? For a dollar, you cannot beat that. Like my crew is gonna be wearing gold toe socks like forever now. And then these were my favorite ones. I love, oh, there's even more in here, hold on. Lordy G. Okay, so this is a totally different pair. You get three pairs. These doesn't, you know, the price is covered up six to 12 and a half, and these are just like black. Um, it looks like they have a little bit of a print. You can't really tell, honestly, but I do see a little, a little bit of a print here. I'll hold it up. I can't tell. I don't know if you're going to be able to tell or not, but there is a print on there, and those are really stacking up. Okay, last but not least, I hope this has, okay, the price on these are $8.99 for a pack. I got two packs. I absolutely love these. Check them out. They are, they got the pink, what is that? A flamingo. They got flamingos. Oh my gosh, I love these. You get three pair, and then look at these. Check these out. How awesome are these? And whenever I bought these, I'm like, surely I can get my leg in those, but I don't know. I, I probably can't. These are the same, the six to 12 and a half. And I just think these are absolutely awesome. Let's see the middle, the middle pair. Look at the toes on them. Are these awesome or what? I, these, these are my, by far my favorite gold toe socks that I found yet. So they had just stocked up, so they had a ton of gold toe. So I was grabbing and growling, needless to say, absolutely. And then I was actually getting ready to check out, and I walked up one more aisle just because I had to go around anyway when I saw this. And I'm like, I really, really like this. I think this would be so pretty with some fairy lights, even if you just hang it on the porch, you know, or just a hook in your kitchen. I just think it'd be really, really pretty. I love that green glass. They also had clear, but where's the fun in that? You know, like where's the fun in clear? I like color and I love this. I love that it has the rope to hang it from, how it's wrapped around perfectly. It's a really good size, as you can see. It's a very good size and I just think it's really, really pretty. I'm just, I was just really glad to find that. So I had not seen those. I was thrilled. Um, <clears throat> so. Me and, well, we haven't yet, but I'm wanting, once my husband, he's back to work like he was like 24 seven basically. So I have, I've been doing, figuring out things that I wanna do because I have a lot of free time. Like I could work all that time, but who wants to do that, you know? So I wanna keep, I wanna continue walking and, and stuff like that. But tomorrow I'm going to the movies by myself. Okay. 12 o'clock matinee or whatever. I'm going to go see either the Eternals or, uh, the house of Gucci. I don't know. Uh, give me a suggestion. What do you suggest? Um, also me and Fifi is going to go bowling a Saturday or a Friday when she gets off work at two. We, me and her's going bowling because I've been wanting to do some bowling. I haven't been bowling in years and years and I'm just ready to have some fun. I'm just ready to go have some fun, okay? And my husband hates to eat out. He just don't like it. I absolutely, on the other hand, love it. So I've decided that from now on, every Thursday night, me and Jack is gonna pick a place in Beckley to go out to dinner. And I'll make sure they have their dinner, you know, but me and Jack are gonna go out to dinner and that's all there is to it. Like, I am ready to have some fun and do a little bit of living, you know? So yeah, there's that. Um, number one, having said all of that, I was just getting to this story here that I'm wanting to continue walking. I have, we haven't been walking in a while because of his job and stuff. And plus we were sick for about a month. So I'm ready to get back to it. I, I found these hats and I absolutely love them. So I was just going to get this one. This reminds me of a sock monkey to tell you the truth. I don't know. 
does it you guys i love because it has the pom-pom on top i would put it on but these things that just pull out of my hair but i'm re um, i'm wanting to wear this i love it and then when i was checking out i saw that they have this one and i'm like i really like that one too i love the pom-poms i just love the hats in general they look way more classier and they feel so well made than a dollar so these really look like some name brand hats they are from juncture so look for those guys if you're looking for a toboggan they're pretty awesome and then i got my hubs one so he wouldn't feel left out so i just got him a solid gray i wasn't sure you know these are the fleece line which will be perfect for him so this is for us hopefully he will get back to walking with me but if not i still have to go like my health depends on it i was enjoying it so much just getting out in the woods and I'll just get me, um, I'll either strap a gun to my side or get me some bear spray or something, you know? Like, I'm not gonna be strapping a gun, let me just say. Um, next, I found this right here. Um, they had so many different colors, I couldn't even just pick which one, which one I wanted. But I had been thinking like a, a couple days before that I really, really needed a green scarf. This green scarf is so long, I mean, can you like, can you even see? Like, it's so long, and it's so gorgeous. I love it, and I've really been kind of into wearing some scarves here lately, and I, you know what? I'm gonna put it on right now, just because. And like, anytime you buy scarves, they always come on one of these. Hey, bracelet, right? Not really, but you know, I, th I'm like, I think I'm gonna wear the scarf today. It kind of goes with the flow of the shirt. It has some you know, it's just, I don't know. I'm, I'm just wearing it. I do have my necklace on. If you guys saw my um, video the other day, um, I th this, this is like one of the most favorite things that I have right now, this necklace. And it's only $20 on Amazon. And I actually ordered one for a family member too. You put the essential oil in this one right now. I have lemongrass. I can't even tell you, like I smell so good right now. <laughs> Let me just say. Um, and then the next few things I sh I'm going to show you is for Hallie's stocking. So I ended up finding some more of these right here. It's the Hard Candy Bath and Body, well, Cherry Blossom Vibes Red Plum and Freesia. And this is Creamy Exfoliating Body Scrub. Can I just say this stuff smells amazing? So I got that for Hallie's stocking. I think that'll be perfect for her. And then also for Hallie. Now, Hallie has a lot of hair. She does. She has a lot of hair. So I got her these right here. And I love these. I got her, um, like, here. One of each pack of these. These feel so good in your hair. And they do not damage your hair. Um, they're just the elastics. And if you can see, I mean, I love these. I absolutely love these. So I thought this would be a really good thing to put in her stocking. Because she could probably really, you know, put her hair up with that. Because they have really good stretch. And it'd be really, you know, non-damaged, damaging for her hair. Um, I also, let's see, what else did I get her? Um, I got this for Josh. If you guys remember seeing Josh, um, which is my youngest son. He's done a video with me before. And his hair is like... Uh, the longest in the family. I don't know. He, he and Hallie's both, but he wears the man bun. And I just thought that this, these are the Sophie brand and this is perfect for his hair coloring um, and stuff. It has all the colors, but like for him to put a man bun, I just thought that might be really good for him. And Hallie can share these as well. If they, you know, if, if, you know, if this will work for them, like their hair is so long and thick, like I'm just amazed. But anyway, that's for my son, Josh. And then I found these right here. I can't remember if I got these for me or Hallie. I think I might put these in Hallie's stocking. They're the Sophie brand, which is a good brand. So I grabbed those. And then I found two really cute hair clips. These are bobby pins, which I'm okay with them sometimes. Um, sometimes when I take them out is when they pull my hair. Um, I love it because they say sweet and spicy. I think that's really cute, and that's like, that top one is not a blue like it looks on there. It's like a clear uh, silver, 
glitter and then the bottom one the spicy one is like a pink glitter but yeah I thought those were really cute I had never seen them before and then these right here I liked as well and these are the clips that you pinch you know like that and they come out which is a lot easier to get out of your hair um, I feel like these probably should have been around around Valentine's Day they say sweet and XOXO I thought that would be cute like if I pulled Jack's bangs back to just to put put these in there you know she hates for me to fix her hair like and I don't know why like I try to fix it so cute I just want to fix it cute every day and she's like always wanting it down um, and then this is something from Sophie which I haven't seen before so I got me one I got the one and then I got Hallie one this is gonna be for their stockings but what it is is a turn it's called a turnover it's a bun shape oh it just says turnover oh turnover so I can see the back maybe I don't know it's a bun shaper so it tells you on the back it shows you how to use it so you just put a ponytail on top of your head and then you slip this down like slip your ponytail in the middle there and then you roll it up and fold it and it looks really easy so I'm like and I probably I don't know my hair is growing um, but I don't know if I have enough for a bun yet but I just thought this was a really cute and cool idea. So all of us got one of those. And then last bag, it just had some drinks that I hadn't seen before. I actually have pictures of these because um, I was wanting to put them over on Instagram. I hadn't done it yet. So by the time you watch this, I may have done it. Um, but anyway, ooh, ooh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. What? Wait, I feel like. Uh -oh, I feel like I'm leaking. Something's leaking somewhere here. And it's all in cans, so I don't know what it is. It didn't get cold enough to freeze, but there's definitely something. I can't tell what the smell is. Um, okay, so this is Jelly Belly. Check it out. Sparkling water, zero carb in watermelon. So I'm like, usually, a, a, usually, a sparkling water is just like, ew. I don't know. Um, I would try this out. I'm gonna try to open it, guys. If it explodes in my car, you'll you'll hear yelling. Okay, I'm gonna try it. Something in that bag is leaking. Let's hope it's not it. Okay, so. Sparkling water, guys. Here goes. It usually, uh, I don't know. Is it going to have a flavor? When I take something fizzy, I feel like I'm kind of digging it, though. I feel like it should be pop. I don't know. Fizzy stuff, fizzy water just kind of gets me. It's like something's wrong, you know? The taste that I get, the watermelon jelly belly, though, after the, the, the fizzy's gone, is excellent. So, let me try it one more time. It's that whole first fizzy without flavor thing with me. I don't know. I mean, I, and then I like the aftertaste. So, does that make any sense? <laughs> anyway, there's that. They also had, and I got one of each, um of these because I was going to give one one to my son as well. So they also had orange sherbet. So I'll be interested in trying that one. And then the other day I hauled some of these twisted punches and they didn't have this one. So this is watermelon punch. This will be his because this has a lot of calories. Three, 290 calories for this thing. That's a lot of calories in a drink. So anyway, he'll be getting this one. I'll have to figure out which one's leaking and I hope it's not in my seat. I can't tell. It's either cold or wet. One of the two. But anyway, guys, I have lost a pack of daggone cough drops. That's so weird. I don't really know. It's kind of weird. Anyway, that's my haul. Um, so now it's time for me to run and go pick up Jack. So I just wanted to make sure I got a Dollar Tree haul in here for you guys. Happy last day of November. Tomorrow's December. Can you believe it? OMG. Tomorrow is December. Wow. Okay. So anyway, if you're not subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button because we are well on our way to 15K and I'm going to have another gorgeous, wonderful, 
fantastic beauty giveaway. Don't you forget it. There'll be two winners and make sure you're subscribed. Make sure to hit that bell button so you'll know when I um, announce the giveaway and you'll know when I announce the winner as well. Um, so anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching and until next time, guys, bye.